Hi everyone, this is Paul Thompson from Spitfire Audio. I'm going to talk you very quickly through updating your um, Logia library to 1.1. Um, so there are, you've downloaded the um, the update and you'll find that, that it expands to a folder called Spitfire Logia library with, which contains an instruments and the NKR, the um, script and graphics and all that kind of stuff packaged up in that NKR. So here is your existing library folder. What we want to do, the first thing that we need to do is we need to delete the NKR and NKC here. Um, if I just sort these by name, you can see that more clearly. The info files, these are the ones that show contact to what the library is. But these two are the containers. This is our main container for all the functionality. And then the NKC is just a local cache uh, version of that, which uh, contact keeps up to date as you go. Um, it's always better to delete that NKC in addition to the NKR before you update, um, because then contact doesn't get confused about which version you're actually running of the of the cache so let's do that first so we move those to the trash and then we'll drag that across into the folder now the next thing to do is to update the orchestral instruments here so let's open the instruments you'll see you've got all the different sections of the library there we open this instruments folder and the next step is to copy over the updated instruments file which you can just literally drag that into here. Um, let's just drag that out a little bit. So you have the original orchestra instruments and you have the updated or orchestra instruments in the V1.1. So just remember that when you're navigating around, next time you open contact, um, uh, rescan the libraries folder and then it, you'll see that you've got these two. If for any reason you're actually within say the horns or the strings folders when you reopen contact you need to navigate back up to the top to make sure you're not still in the existing um, instruments folder and so you can select the new one. You can always delete this, this old one if you want to. So that's it. That's basically how you update. Okay, thanks very much. See you on the next one.